Stella Bella's Bake Shop. Follow her on yeah. Instagram. That's how you can place an order for cookies as well as her Facebook page. And man, are they tasty. She has several kinds that she's baked up for us this morning. You want to tell me what flavors those are, Stella? We've got chocolate chip, sugar, oatmeal chocolate chip, and we're about to ice the iced sugar. Okay, so this, I'm, I'm, I cannot ice these cookies. You're a pro, though. Can you show me how it's done? Mm-hmm. So you'll start from the side. Okay. And you'll just push, and don't drag it. Oh, okay. Push it and let it go. Oh, wow, that looks so difficult. Well, you're doing such a good job. Um, I'm going to bring in your mom to talk about how um, how kind of Stella got started with this. I know she was, like, asking for a while if she could have a real cookie business. Right. Uh, I was kind of hesitant. You know, I have my own business, and we're busy, and you never know if a kid is going to outgrow their idea. But she was pretty persistent. Um, we went to the Indianapolis Kids Museum, did a Barbie exhibit about dream gaps for girls, and it was just really eye-opening on how many girls have a dream and then are that they can't do something and they believe it and they stop dreaming really dreaming big so I decided that we were gonna go for it and that was mid-December so we have been at it since then it's been about two and a half months that we've been busy and it's been terrific it's also been a really cool opportunity for Stella because you've been able to donate cookies to um, a lot of different charities here do you remember which ones those were Stella uh, we've done the family scholar house and the um st joe's children yes is that it yeah. how did that feel to be able to support local charities with your cookies it felt amazing because i knew i was making a difference absolutely okay so this is not done yet we have the yummy buttercream icing but you need some sprinkles don't you yep is that your favorite part Mm-hmm. okay so tell me too you have big dreams because you're you're baking in your kitchen right now but you hope to have a store one day mm -hmm. what do you hope people you, you want people to come in drive through what what's the plan I think that I want people to be able to get their cookies, drink warm milk with them, and if they, they're not in the mood to stay, they can just go through a drive through order, and get the cookies. Okay, cool. Listen, you might be really busy in the coming days. Are you ready for the hard work? Mm-hmm. She's ready. And what's your favorite cookie so people know which ones to order? Oatmeal chocolate chip. She says that she believes that the, the Clydesdale named Larry that she's going to buy with some of her money is also going to like those oatmeal chocolate chips because <laughs> there's oats in them, right? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. She's going to have Clydesdales volunteering to come to her with that kind of offer. I kind of want to check back in with True. her in a few weeks after she gets this load of business yeah. and see if she's on the couch, like, exhausted. Like, <laughs> wait a minute, maybe I'm too young. Right? I yeah. just have fun. She shuts down her Instagram for a little while to take a break. No, no we're, we're excited for her. Yeah. All right, Alex, thank you.